And we have Brittany. She also has a concern about something back there. I know dimples on the face are cute, but dimples on the butt, ugh, not so much. Why do I have these? How can I get rid of them? <sighs> and Brittany is here with us now, and you are very brave to do this too. Shall we take a little peek? I'm ready. I like the dimples on your face. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so, you know, typically, if you have some irregularity in your derriere area, you what you think either cellulite, which most women have a certain degree of, or there are congenital dimples that we see more higher up on the sacrum. Correct, sacrum. correct, yes. So cellulite is actually an issue more for women than for men, and it has to do with the connective tissue. So people who have cellulite, the connective tissue is an open mesh, and it doesn't keep that fat next to the muscle, which is why men have a tighter connective tissue, keeping that fat next to the muscle. So you can get a little bit that bubbles up. And the treatment for it, for you, you don't want to go in there and really laser. There are some tissue tightening devices that can be used, but for you, if you do the stairs, even if there's stairs at home or stairs in your office, and some weight, squats. some squats, it's all about exercise and keeping your weight within the right limit for you. You know, and, and other tips when we talk about cellulite, we know there's no cure. We call it fat that's gone wild, like you said, that's gone <laughs> through that connective tissue. But yes. I think diet, you know, having a good diet, uh, trying to eliminate refined sugars, drinking plenty of water, but I think the key, you hit the nail on the head, is getting a lot of exercise that that really focuses on your your glutes. So you want to be sure that you stay away from processed foods and anything that's going to bump your blood sugar up. Lots of vegetables, high quality proteins, and fruits. There are some creams designed for cellulite. They have caffeine in them that they can help reduce swelling, but they're a temporary fix. So if you're really looking to like keep that booty up high and tight, it's all about the stairs. And Dr. Shamban mentioned some treatments. There's some at-home things you can do. They talk about applying coffee grinds and, and things like that, sea salt. Try it. You may get a little bit of improvement, but the key, it's going to be temporary. That's right. That's Thank right. Thank you. Thank you, doctor. You're welcome.